crispy skin, juicy meat, and serious flavor. Deep fried turkey is a Southern favorite, and at just three minutes per pound to cook, it's as fast food as turkey gets. Deep frying works best with a fresh small bird around 12 to 15 pounds. Make sure your turkey is totally thawed before you fry, and don't forget to spice it up. Cajun-style turkeys combine an injected marinade and a dry rub just under the skin 12 hours before frying to produce their special flavor. Here's what you'll need to fry a turkey. A heavy-duty portable propane burner, a large stock pot or a custom-made turkey frying pot, a heavy-duty cooking thermometer, a fry basket or turkey hanger to safely lower into and remove the turkey from the fryer, and oil with a high smoking point, like peanut oil. Be safe and fry smart. Wash your hands and surfaces thoroughly whenever handling raw poultry. Always fry outdoors away from buildings and trees. Make sure the fryer is on level ground and never fry on a wooden deck. It's a good idea to keep a household fire extinguisher nearby. Step one, determine the oil amount. Some fryers come with a fill-to line. If yours doesn't, lower the turkey into the cold fryer and add water until it reaches about two inches above the turkey. Now remove the turkey and note where the water level is on the pot. Pour out the water, dry the pot thoroughly, and add oil to equal the water level without the turkey in the pot. Step two, heat the oil. Turn on the fry heat and wait 20 to 30 minutes for the oil to reach 325 degrees. Step three, remove the giblets. Keep the gizzard, heart, and neck for gravy or stuffing recipes, but always discard the liver. Step four, rinse the turkey. Make sure to rinse the bird with cold water inside and out several times. Step five, lower the turkey into the fryer. Place the turkey in a basket or on the turkey hanger and slowly lower it into the pot. Step six, set your timer. Plan on about three minutes per pound to cook. A 12 to 15 pound turkey will only take about 40 minutes. Step seven, test for doneness. When the turkey is close to the estimated time limit, lift it slowly out of the fryer and onto a platter. Insert a meat thermometer in the leg away from the bone. Your turkey is done at 180 degrees. Gently lower it back in the fryer if it's not done. For easy carving and juicy slices, let the fried turkey rest for 15 minutes before using a sharp, unserrated knife to cut the meat. Enjoy the fastest, crispiest, juiciest turkey ever, and it's so easy when you fry it.